We're going to show you 13 mind-blowing video editing tips, all using a wildly underrated video editing program, Movavi. We were actually blown away by how much this thing could do, so we put together some of our best tricks so you could take your videos to the next level. Let's go. If you want to easily create an 80s inspired VHS aesthetic, just select the blade tool and cut off a section at the beginning of your clip. Then go up to effects in the left toolbar, then filters and find the VHS filter. Then drop it onto the first half of your clip. Then under overlay effects, find the old tape 8 effect and drop it onto both clips. Play it back and you'll get this vibey retro 80s VHS look. Movavi actually has a built-in AI noise removal feature, so you can clean up your audio with just a few clicks. Just select your clips, go up to More Tools, then under the Audio tab, click Noise Removal. Select Artificial Intelligence and click Apply. Movavi will then use AI to analyze your audio and remove background noise, clicks, pops, buzzing from mics, and any other distracting sounds for you. This is a trick we love to use, especially when editing music videos, trailers, or anything else cut to music. Whenever you have a music track in your timeline that you want to edit your video to, just select it, go to More Tools in the sidebar, and then under the Audio tab, click Beat Detection. Movavi will automatically mark audio beats on the timeline. You can then just line up your video clips with these markers, and your edits will always be perfectly on beat. Occasionally, you may have to censor someone or something in your video. If this ever happens, you can use Movavi's built-in AI motion tracking to assist and save you tons of time. Under Video, go to Highlight and Conceal, and then choose a mask. We'll use Blurred Eclipse. Then just go to Reshape the Oval to cover what you're trying to blur out, in this case, the woman's face. Under Mask Properties, turn up the feathering, then just go to Motion Tracking and click Track. Movavi will use AI to automatically track your character and keep the blur effect over their face. Films like The Batman have particularly mind-blowing cinematography because they dirty the frame. You can do this to your own images by simply adding in elements like lens dust in post. Just find a lens dust image, drop it into your scene, and scale it to match your shot. Then change the blending mode to screen, then lower the opacity on the entire thing so it blends well with your shot. Most video editors have effects nowadays, but Movavi actually has an entire effects store as well built right in, so you can shop for extra effects you want and add them right into your project without ever leaving the app. If you want to go for a style that's more down to earth, you can get a sketch graffiti look by searching for Noise 2 in the effects panel. Then just drag and drop this right under your clips. Click the FX symbol on your clip and you can adjust the settings of any applied effects under clip properties. Lower the opacity down to about 55% and you're done. Or you can combine effects to get more unique and intense looks. One easy way to spice up a video edit is to add a flash glitch transition. Under filters in the left toolbar, select the broken lens filter and drag it and drop it on your first clip. Next, select the blade tool and use it to cut a piece off the end of the first clip. Then drag and drop the invert filter onto just that piece. Play it back and you'll get this awesome flash glitch transition effect to punch up any impactful moments in your edit. Movavi has an insane AI motion tracking feature built in. Just drop in the asset you want to add to your scene and double click it to open the motion tracking tab. Set the frame on the object you want to track and then select your tracking method. For this example, we're going to choose AI. Then just click track and Movavi will use AI to have your asset tracked to the object you selected in your scene. If you want to make your shots easily look way more interesting, add a full foreground. Take an image of the element you want to have in the foreground and then bring it into an app like Pixel Cut to remove the background. Then drop this new foreground element into your project above another shot. Then add a blur effect or even change the blending mode to multiply until it looks like it's out of focus in the foreground. Take any aerial environment shot looking at the horizon, then add the vertical mirror filter. To make this effect look even more trippy, you can add a faux dolly zoom by adding a zoom in the opposite direction of where the camera's traveling. If you already have a video with different scenes clipped together that you want to edit, you can use Movavi's Scene Detection tool. Just select the video in the timeline, then go up to Video, and then Scene Detection. You can even choose the minimum duration of a scene so it doesn't make cuts that are shorter than you'd like. Then just click Detect Scenes and it will automatically make cuts at the beginning of every new shot for you. You can then edit, remove, or rearrange these clips in any way you want. If you want to easily get a 70s grindhouse look that's perfect for horror films, B-movie style action, or any dark retro vibe, just go to Effects in the Toolbar and then Overlay Filters and search Noise 3. Then just drag it and drop it onto your clips. Instant Grindhouse.
These are just a few of the tricks you can do in Movavi, and it's actually insane how much you can do with it. We were blown away that it had all these features, so go try them out yourself at the link in the description and make something amazing with it. We'll see you in the next one.